Happy Memorial Day, y'all. Um, last night I wrote this poem about sin and uh, the many different types of sins that people commit. So um, like, share, and support, and uh, drop a you know a topic, you know a subject for me to write about in the comment section. All right, check this out. Sin is like a magnet to the flesh, and every time you give in, you resist it less and less. Some sins cause your whole life to be a mess. Some sins shorten your life with guilt and stress. Sin is always looking for a new partner, young and fresh. If it it's in any space you make, it will push and press. The sin nature makes a child steal from the store, causes a married man to sleep with a whore, and no matter how much sin you get, you always want more. You will wear yourself down until your whole body is sore from sun up to sundown until you pass out on the floor. You will gamble everything you have, even if it makes you poor. It will make you take your mom's jewelry to the pawn shop. It will make a stable-minded person flip-flop. It will make a cautious person drive into danger nonstop. It will bring a man to the bottom who used to be on top. It's the difference between a good police officer and a crooked cop. They seem to get worse with each generation, from early masturbation to full-blown fornication. A person who rapes started as a child. It started off mild, and it grew with age into something more ruthless and wild. A killer most likely killed as a kid, and it probably started small and was easily hid, and it keeps growing until they get caught for what they did. And most people don't notice until that person is doing a bid. This is a poem about the different types of sin and the many stages they begin. We must be careful of who and what we let in. And remember that through Jesus Christ, we can overcome and win. And that's my poem about sin, y'all.